We're off to New Zealand. Yay! This is my fly outfit. We made it to the airport. We're going to the lounge now to have a couple drinks while we wait for our flies. Queenstown, where the local time is approaching 10 minutes to 8. Please remain seated with your seatbelts fastened. I'm feeling lost again. Thinking of way back when. Every night I'd sit down to write. Dear diary. No longer an ink affair. My fingers. Good morning guys, we made it to New Zealand last night at about 8.30 p.m. Honestly, I was exhausted. We just went to dinner in the hotel and then went straight to bed. But I wanted to show you our view this morning. We're staying at the Hilton in Queenstown and it's beautiful. But today we have an action-packed agenda. We're going to the hot onsen pools this morning and then we have this steamboat cruise for lunch. Oh, also, it's my boyfriend's birthday so I decorated for him. Let me show you. How cute is this love it and then i put these photos out i blew some balloons i'm just showing them my decorations this is my outfit today just a puffer a jumper jeans you haven't even been introduced on the vlog do you like decorations yeah love them you can love talk em. you know <laughs> We just got to the onsen hot pools and look at our view, it's amazing. We've got wine already, 9.30 in the morning. What a beautiful day. Are you enjoying your birthday so far? Boy. Wonderful. Best birthday ever. What an amazing view. What a view. <laughs> <laughs> We just got back to the room. We have to leave again for this cruise that we're going on. But I wanted to show you my outfit. I quickly got changed. I'm wearing a white jumper, my teddy bear jacket, these leather pants, and then sneakers. I'm ready. We're going on a steamboat. I'm so, I'm so shaky. Okay. Oh, perfect timing. We're on our cruise now. We're going to 
<laughs> we're going to Walter Peak Farm. The lighting is terrible. And we're doing this farm demonstration and then we get to have a barbecue. I'm so excited. So we're on a steamboat now. We've got our mild wine. Cheers. And we were so time pressured, but we made it. And look at the view. Beautiful. Doggo? Hey! Hi! You're so beautiful! Oh, you want more? <laughs> oh my gosh, the doggo was so cute! It came and cuddled right next to me! Do you like it here? <laughs> Wait, I'm so zoomed in! <laughs> We just got to Walter Peak Farm and there's animals that the people are going to think all you can do is tip, poke out your tongue. There's animals that just come up to you and the doggos were so cute. Look, look, there they are. Oh, oh this one, this one's my bestie. Hey. Oh, okay, he's going. Nature or what? Looks like we're not in the same temperature. our demonstration we saw the duckies we saw the unicorns <laughs> and dogs. saw the dogs they were amazing we love dogs and now we're heading back we're on the steam steam steamship steamship there's so many people we're off. Beautiful day. Can we please get one Ferg burger with cheese? Ah, yes, please. That's all. All right, we got off the boat. We bought matching beanies, and now we're having our Ferg burger, which is apparently the best burger in the, in the world. Can I try mine first? Yummy. Good? As good as you remember? My phone's died, my camera's about to die. I'm well, going. Beautiful eyes. Mine or yours? <laughs> How was the fake burger? <coughs> The ones we are looking at Ready for the laugh. I have it. Oh my god, it's so big. We're in a gondola now going up to our restaurant. Look at this view. This is the most adventurous thing we've done this trip. <laughs> What a view. That's amazing. Good morning, my beautiful people. It is a new day here in Queenstown. We're going on a jet boat this morning, which 
that's pretty adventurous of me i'm so proud of myself and then we have a whole day of wine tours so we're doing a bus tour and then they take you to four different wineries and cave tour as well i don't know i'm really excited this is my outfit just wearing a blue top it's actually not that cold here surprisingly i think it's just a different type of weather but it's been so literally so beautiful i can't even believe it i would come back here in a heartbeat and it's only two and a half hour flight from sydney as well so it's so convenient are we ready guess where we're going for brekkie <laughs> we went there last night at 11 p.m because i was craving Ooh. one all right i'm ready do you guys like marcus's new jacket stunning Stylish. Stylish, let's go, let's go. I think today's gonna be our best day yet. Yeah? Yeah, I have a best feeling. Ever. We're about to go on the jet boat. Strapped in now, ready to go. Strapped in and ready. We just finished the jet boating. <laughs> My fingers are literally numb. They're not moving. I was so unprepared for that. The one day I don't bring a beanie. Honestly, I've never been colder. <laughs> beanie gloves, you need them both. The whole right side's wet, but we're all right, we'll get there. I don't think you understand. My fingers, they don't move. <laughs> <laughs> no. The first half I forgot to put my hair up, so the whole time my hair was just in my face. <laughs> now we're just going to do a wonder. We've been dropped off because they couldn't handle us anymore. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. They've been they've dropped us off because we're about to do a wine tour and it was all part of the one package, so they're gonna pick us up from here in about 20 minutes. Look how beautiful this place is. Where are we? Do you know? You don't Queenstown. know. Queenstown. <laughs> Get onto it, mate. Wow. It's so beautiful That's here. Like Where? And uh, it didn't always look like this. 30 or 40 years ago, it was just a dry, dusty gully with a few sheep and a lot of rabbits. Tasting room they've built here using a lot of local stone on the right, which has four beautiful. separate. Mount Rosso Wines now. We're doing our wine tour. This is our first stop. It's a small family owned winery apparently. Is that right? <laughs> <laughs> I don't listen. I don't know. We just came outside. What a beautiful view. Who decided to do a jet boat right before a wine tour, Marcus? Who does that? Me. My hair's terrible now. <laughs> can you say something so that they know your words can come out of you? <laughs> I'm on mute today. <laughs> I gotta keep the camera out all the time. Is that the only way to mute you? The rosé, the Pinot Noir 17, 18, and the reserve. Sorry. The dark red it is. Yeah. Yeah. Because you get rosé and get me. Yeah. Light. So light. Generally. Hi. Hi. Maybe they'll leave me outside. Oh no! Come back in. Come. <laughs> <laughs> Put him back.
There's somebody I look up to, I could only hope to be If we had the conversation and know exactly what he say to me What he say to me He would say you'll be Guys, I'm a bit stressed because I think I might lose Marcus this wine tour. <laughs> Some ladies trying to crack on to him. <laughs> Guys, take a look at this because it will be the last day we see him. We're at Kinross Winery now. We're gonna do a tasting and then head back into town. I don't mind. Creamy texture makes it real easy to drink. It might seem a little bit sweeter than it is because it doesn't have. Yay! Should we okay, see? Happy birthday <laughs> to you. <laughs> Share it. <laughs> We got an ice bar, which we get to smash later. We're live! Michael's got a free drink for his birthday, didn't even show it me. Sometimes you just gotta do it. <laughs> It is a new day here in Queenstown, New Zealand. It is our last full day here. So sad. Today we are taking our car because we rented a car the other day and we haven't really used it. So today we decided to take the car for a drive and go on a bit of a day trip and just explore different places. Marcus has organized it all so I don't even know what we're doing. It's 8 a.m. so we woke up so early this morning. We woke up at 6.30. We woke up before the sunrise and it was so beautiful. The view. We'll do a little more so you can see it so beautiful now it's 8 a.m we're about to eat breakfast and then see what the day takes us but i've just had the best trip ever yesterday was so much fun and then on the way back from the ice but on the way back he's watching me it is just so fun to travel with a partner as well like i was just thinking about it on the drive and a year ago i was dreaming about having a partner to travel with and, and now i do and we've traveled so many different places this year we've just had the best time ever together and i i just i love it and it's so fun to travel with a partner over parents as well sometimes because my dad never used to want to do certain things and now i get to do whatever i want and it's a dream that is the plan so i hope you guys are liking these vlogs and if you want to see more travel vlogs let me know because we're always going somewhere and i just never vlog it okay and he's slowly getting used to the camera i mean he's all he's done is put his tongue out you know what that's progress we're getting somewhere all right we're getting somewhere soon he'll be saying like simple words and then eventually we'll get him onto sentences all right but just small steps all right let's go going to brecky now where are we marcus cromwell in cromwell it's lit up already. Should we go to the bar already? Can't believe the bar's not open. Unbelievable. Cromwell Bakery. This is as good as fair. We just finished breakfast, it was yummy. Now where are we going, Marcus? Mercas? <laughs> Mercas, where are we going? The people wanna know. All right, that's enough for today. Talk to you guys later. <laughs> Don't look at the camera, look at the road, mate. Look at the road. Mate. Ah. <laughs> Oh my god, should we tell them this video? <laughs> should we tell them about our friends from Noosa? We went to Noosa a few weeks ago and we did this gin tasting experience and it was actually so much fun, we recommend it. But anyway, on our gin tasting experience we met this guy from Noosa and honestly he was the most Aussie man I've ever met in my life. <laughs> and 
towards the end of the tasting, every five seconds he would be like, my, literally that's how he would say it. And then when I got home from the trip, all I could say all week was my, and now every time we say it, we just laugh. Ooh, Ooh. look at this. You trying to bring us here? No. Oh, okay. <gasps> We're coming here. I put my beanie on because it's freezing, but we just got to this other little village in Cromwell and it looks so beautiful here. The view is insane. And this town is so cute. Kind of looks like something out of Beauty and the Beast, don't you reckon, Mocas? Have I been missing your letters? Did you write me at all? Or have I just forgotten how hard I fall? Is he stretching out your belt loops? With his fingers and his thumbs Doing everything that I do Was I not good enough? Does it feel better in your hands? Does it treat you better? We're just wandering around, we're the only ones here. We need to know the history markers, make something up. Whoa! This is. Wait for it. Tacula. Just really keeping the suspense going. We are just driven down to another lookout and this view is sensational, but the camera just will not capture it. It it just doesn't look remotely as good as it looks in real life, but it is incredible. Incredible. We are now going to this place where you catch your own salmon and then they prepare it for you. Isn't that so fun? But I only want to eat the sashimi. And they played it so beautifully. It's from lake to plate. Ready to go, ready to fish. Fish, 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 fish. fish. I've got my fishing rod here. Then we have some salmon to catch the fish and then some fish food to draw them out. That's our little container that we put our fish in. And then after you can decide how you want your fish prepared and then they prepare it for you. $10 per rod and then it's $32 per kilogram. It's an extra $20 depending on how they prepare it. So if you want it sashimi style or normal style or whatever. Do you feel anything? Huh? Do you feel anything? Yeah. What are you doing? You bought already? <laughs> <laughs> but I'm not ready. We've got to do one at a time. You're not going to catch it now. What? Does it take time? <laughs> <laughs> what? Yeah. I thought it comes straight away. Yeah. Uh, for hours. What? Trying to get a single fish? Are you going to eat it? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so what do I do? <laughs> and is that good lighting, Marcus? Prioritize the vlog, yeah? <laughs> and now what? Just wait. Fishing is not as fun as I thought, and all I can say is I know why people sit down when they fish. It's so slow. We haven't even caught one yet, and it's been five minutes. <laughs> I've given up. There's my rod. Marcus is going to catch one for us. Come on, Marcus. This is your time to shine. Or not. It's okay. We just spoke to the guy and he said it's a bad day to be a human and a good day to be a fish because they're not they're not coming out to play today. So they're no sleeping. One's, they're sleeping. So <laughs> no one's been catching any. So devastating. So we're just going to order a sashimi platter now. We've got our mulled wines. This is a vibe. Cheers. <laughs> this is our fish. We caught that. We asked this them. One? Yeah. The green one. The green one too. That was a bit of seaweed that came with it. Dear diary, I'm feeling 